Hello and welcome back to Minecraft Sky Factory 4. I am Lord Foreman, here with some nice pleasant music, apparently. So, the goal of this episode is to either get petrified saplings, or almost more importantly, climb up and destroy that really annoying husk spawner that is up above my base. So, we are going to gather wood and then hopefully be able to go destroy it. Yeah, we'll see how that goes. I, I don't have high, 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 high hopes, but you never know. Also, still harvesting birch wood, because we're going to obviously continuously need to expand our base. And as far as I can tell, there's no better way than using these birch stuff early on, because we do not have access to virtually anything else at the moment. Yeah. At least the birch wood trees tend to be larger than the oak ones slightly. So more wood, more bang for our buck. And uh, yeah, um, I could build a ladder. Probably shouldn't. It'll probably be, uh, you know, a ladder might actually be really efficient to get up there. I know I like to build staircases, but uh, I don't remember how to build a ladder. Okay, a ladder requires lots of sticks. Fair enough. We have a fair amount of sticks, but obviously we'll need more. So let's do lots of sticks, and then as many ladders as we can. I should be doing it not that way. I've completely forgotten what they look like. Ah, that makes sense. Okay. I can do that. There we go. We'll get 24 ladders. That's got to be more than enough. And uh, now I just need to get some more birch wood. There we go. All of a sudden, these trees are spawning when I need them to. It's convenient. You guys missed the off-camera time, I think after episode 2, where it took me like 15 minutes to spawn another tree. It was awful. I guess it just didn't work. I had to keep picking up putting down the sapling, because it was inter must have been trying to grow a big tree and there's stuff above me. So, Okay, we've got birch stuff. Where is the spawner exactly? Right there. Okay. Um, how do I want to do... Okay! Uh, what I want to do is actually fight this guy first. Bye-bye. Ha, he died on my other thing. Um, I could technically try and make, like, a mob spot, mob dropper thing for these guys, but maybe when I find, like, an actual zombie spawner that's not above my base, I'll do that. Uh, oh my gosh, what is this? Oh, it's nighttime. Okay, let's go sleep. Then we'll go deal with it, because I'm not going to try and climb up there while being sh killed. Ooh, not what I want to see. Okay, we also need a supply of food. More than what I have. I suppose right now if I die, there's, you know, I die, so. Um, how do I want to do this? Um, I suppose I should build up on the side rather than actually, like, directly next to this column of things. Oh, um, okay. Let's think about this for a minute. Uh, how do I put up the ladder while I'm going up? The answer is carefully. Very carefully. Oh, can I not place... Oh, I must not be able to place a ladder down on the block I'm on. That makes sense. It's just annoying. Um, there we go. And down. And place, please. There we go. At least I remembered you can hold on with ladders. Please tell me I can break this. Yes. Please break. Oh, good. 
That's a rabbit. Oh, isn't it cute? That looks like the killer bunny or something. Um, is, wait a second. That's a rabbit spawner. And somehow the rabbit crossed two, three wide gaps to get to the top of that. That's impressive. Polar bear. I'm going to assume hostile. Yeah, I'd say hostile. Um, we're going to get rid of that spawner. You don't feel the need to keep a polar bear spawner near my base. And now we're going to kill the polar bear at range. Or not, because it apparently just fell all the way down to near my base. I'm going to leave the bunny spawner. I don't think the bunny is a problem. I think we're good. Okay, um, we are considerably high above our base. Um, I should try and get rid of some of these blocks above my base, if at all possible. First off, bye bye polar bear. Hopefully. Yes, okay, polar bear is gone. Um, actually, I should be able to get rid of this. Okay, these are just birch. These are just leaves left over. It's this stuff I need to get rid of. And the bookcase and that. The treasure chest, I think, is fine. Okay. Slabs again, apparently. And then dirt. And then a bookcase. And I didn't get the books. Because I'm an idiot. Okay. Let's harvest that. Get some wheat coming in. We need, a, obviously, a lot more wheat income if we're going to live off wheat. But, uh... Oh, we did get a book. Nice. We got a book. Um... What can I put down somewhere? I suppose I could put down the oak slabs, leave the book. Oh, there we go. Okay. And we still have some ladders and other stuff we'll store in this chest down here. Okay. Achie uh, mission one, destroy spawners, done. Mission two... Um... Get some petrified saplings, I guess. I still want to kill that skeleton spawner over there, along with that zombie spawner, but can't do that yet. Can't do it. The skeleton one is going to be a pain. Ugh. Trying to approach skeletons on a narrow platform when they're shooting at me, I'm going to need a lot of wood and a fair amount of luck. A fair amount of luck. Um, really wish there was a way to increase generation of acorns, but it seems to... At least the mod pack is not telling me there is. I suppose I could use a sword, but why would one want to use a sword when one can just punch it with your fists? Still hunting for more acorns. I need eight acorns. I think I've got five or so. Okay, anything else? No. Okay. Um, yeah, I should have enough acorns now. Uh, let's get another dirt tree going. I need to really clear out this area, but I can't yet. So. No pigs have spawned. Probably because they're going to die if they spawn? I don't know. It's rather weird that we've got rabbits, but not pigs. 37, okay. Um, let's try this last acorn. Oops, that was dumb. I took it off. Whoops, my bad. Um, we've got ladders, we got wood, we've got a sword. Still don't have food, but... Uh, that's going to have to wait, honestly. I really need another... Okay, I got another dirt block. 
We're going to plant that here. Should do reasonably well, I guess. Can I get rid of that? Okay, sandstone gone. Okay, that way we can actually grow a petrified sapling. There's a place to put it down. And I need one dirt sapling, and I need this last one done, pretty much. I believe I remember the rap recipe, so that should work. And I took it off right before the end, because I'm an idiot. Okay. I'm not an idiot, I'm just not paying attention sometimes. There we go. One petrified sapling. Achievement gained. Hardwood. Cool. Now I need to get a rustic crushing tub. Rustic. Rustic. I spelled it wrong, obviously. Crushing. Oh, it's just a crushing tub. Planks followed by slabs will give us a crushing tub. So let's do that. Uh, let's do planks. And then we'll do slabs. Oh, I think I can use different ones. Yep. Okay, we now have an achievement called I Love Lucy. Rustic crushing tub. That's obviously a reference to the I Love Lucy. The, like... Lucille Ball shows and stuff, but... Or maybe it's actually it's probably a reference to I Love Lucy. Um, let's figure out how we need the, this clay sapling. Sapling, sapling, sapling. Clay acorns around the dirt sapling. Hmm. Petrified resin on top of dirt resin upon a dirt sapling will give us a clay sapling. Okay. Um, gravel. Gravel sapling is gravel acorns on a petrified sapling. Gravel acorns come from crushing a petrified acorn in a rustic crushing tub. Interesting. I'll give them that. Definitely interesting. Let's get this tree grown. I want to see what a petrified tree looks like or petrified sapling. Assuming it will grow. Hopefully nothing's going to be in its way. I think I got rid of everything that will be in its way. Unless it's reading that as in its way. Nope. Okay. Petrified log. Cool. I'm curious about this thing that keeps showing up in the too many items called a bonsai thing. I have to look into that. Okay. Now all we need is a petrified sapling. A petrified acorn. Awesome. I think I'm kind of figuring out what the tree progression stuff is. You use some from one step to grow the next, to grow the next, to grow the next. I think the crushing tub legitimately will be me jumping on top of an acorn over and over and over until it gets crushed. That does kind of fit the mod pack creator's humor. Okay. Yep. It involves me jumping on it to get gravel acorns. <laughs> oh boy, never change. Okay, jumping on that does nothing. Okay, just wanting to check. We'll throw up another giant rack because we'll probably need it. Take that, store that there. Got three gravel acorns already. Awesome. And then we need some more dirt resin, I believe. Oh, helps if I... Oh. I... No, okay. For some reason that didn't show up against the background. For some reason I thought I harvested it and then destroyed all the saplings. Oh, I would have been so angry if I'd done that. Because that would have just been stupid. Okay, come on, game. Give me some saplings and some acorns. Uh, 
uh, one. Not exactly what I needed. On the other hand, with this resin and a dirt sapling, I should be able to get a new tree if I got it right. I think it was this. Yes. Clay saplings. Awesome. We just got the achievement Clay Aiken. Lovely. Boy, whoever creates this mod pack loves references. Okay, we'll throw that here. I need more acorns, honestly. It looks like acorns are going to be... Dirt acorns are going to be really key to progress here. I think they might be one of my bigger... Uh, points at which I'm not going to be able to do well until I get tons of them. Okay. okay, we've got enough to make another thing of dirt, which is why I wanted them. Um, if I remember, it's this. Yes, another dirt. Um, we will stick this one here, and we will put a clay sapling on it. I think that will grow. Really need a food source, obviously. Um, we have a petrified acorn I can stomp on again. Another gravel one. To build the gravel sapling, we need eight gravel acorns. I'm noticing an odd pattern here. <laughs> um, okay, I'm thinking it also might be worth trying to maybe clear out space above the base here. I'm running out of space to grow trees over there. I really need iron. When do I get iron? We've got cotton to be kidding me, sand saplings, tin. I don't get iron till I get iron wood. Ugh. Hmm. Hmm. Don't get that till I get coal saplings. I can't do much else. Oh, here we go. Use a wooden crook on leaves. Duh. Awesome. I figured there must be something like that, but I guess not. Okay, and then you get lava, right click on a cauldron while using cobble. To melt cobblestone, you have to have a torch, fire, magma block, or lava directly under your cauldron. Okay, so there is some stuff I can do to make this more efficient. Cobblestone generator, is that an actual item? I don't think so. I know what a cobblestone generator looks like in game, but I'm just wondering if they bothered to create an item. No. Yeah. Actually, they have it. Cobblestone generators involve... Oh. I think that just counts as a bucket. Then I need cobblestone... And glass, and I think I can make a cobblestone generator. Ooh. Obviously, I need lava and I need water, but I can get lava and I can get water. I have water down there. Huh. I may have something here. Cobblestone generator, that would be nice. So, in order to do that, I need cobblestone. I suppose I can make just an amateur cobblestone generator, too. But for that, I need a bucket, which means I need iron. I don't have iron. Ugh, so much is gated behind getting iron in Minecraft. It's a little annoying. Clay bucket. I don't think I have any cobblestone left, do I? I've got one cobblestone. I don't really want to go on a hunt for cobblestone, to be honest. Hmm. Not sure where to go next. Obviously, I've got trees to grow, things to do here. Which will be awesome when I get it going. I'm just wondering what the... There's got to be an easier way of getting cobblestone other than building a cobblestone dinner. Come on, grow you two trees. I don't want to be sitting here hitting shift all day. 
Really? Nope. Nothing. Nothing at all. Okay, well, let's spend some of this wood and grow this platform to a slightly more useful size. There we go. Well, it's nice that we have this nice three three spaced grid everywhere because now I can kind of measure how big my stu structure is getting without actually having to count. <sighs> nope, not what I wanted. I think those saplings may not be growing because there might be stuff counting above them. Uh, let's get clay. As much clay as we can get, apparently. And we're out of it. Okay, that's fine. I'll put a slab down to fill in that hole. Come on, grow, 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 grow. Not happening. That one grew, though. Not really what I needed. Okay, I may grind off camera a little bit here to pick up some more saplings. I'm not sure yet. Because we're nearing the end of another episode and the tree generation, while nice, is not as rapid as I would like it. Plus I need to build a crook. Let's build a crook before I forget. Um, I do not remember how to build a crook, but I'm sure it'll involve sticks. Helps if I remember how to spell crook. Oh, let's just look in the achievement guide. Oh, two O's, duh. Crook. Sticks. Awesome. I'm probably going to end up using a lot, so I'll build a couple. There we go. Four crooks. Let's increase the rate of sapling and other drops. Oh, yeah. There we go. That's going to make a difference. Also, we got an achievement called Captain Hook. Really should be Captain Crook, but I think that's another achievement. It was a big tree too. Get that one. Okay. Well, that is certainly a rapid increase. Didn't get as many acorns as I wanted though. How many do I need for petrified three? Okay. Now, can I get these out without everything else? Yes. Awesome. Okay, we've got seven gravel. I think we need a petrified sapling, which we have. We need eight. Oops. I need one more. Uh, it's eight. It's always eight. It's either eight or nine in Minecraft, it seems. And then we cover it with gravel acorns. Shoot. I went over the gravel tree in the middle. And that gets us a gravel sapling. Awesome. Progress is being made. Okay. Well, on that note, I considering grinding. Not sure yet. Regardless, time for my character to sleep. And pretty much time for me to say goodbye for this episode. So hopefully you guys are enjoying this. I am. We're actually making some fairly good progress now that we've gotten... Uh, stuff going. I need to figure out how to do bone sapling. That's obviously going to be a thing. Yeah, bone meal. Yeah. I actually have some bones upstairs. So let's see how much bones I have, how much I'll need to get. I may need to go farm skeletons, which I'm not looking forward to doing. I don't remember how much bone comes out of bone. Bone meal comes out of bones. That's six. We need eight so i'm gonna have to find some way to get some bones from that skeleton or zombie spawner probably skeleton spawner so that will be it for this episode next episode well i'm gonna try and get to that spawner without getting killed by the skeletons so thank you guys all for watching bye for now